and Cakey Fishing Adventures. I'm Isaias. And I'm Elijah. We have an awesome show for you today. Jerry and Sarai go salmon fishing in San Francisco. That's right, they have salmon in San Francisco. Sarai and Jerry catch some huge salmon. They go salmon fishing on two separate days. Jaden and Sarai, the girls and the boys. Who catches the biggest fish? What do you think? So today we're going to try and catch salmon. When most people think of salmon, they think of rivers and Alaska. They think of the salmon swimming and jumping up waterfalls to try and lay their eggs in the riverbeds. With bears trying to catch them. And even their little cubs trying. There's even people trying to fish for them. But dams are the biggest threat to salmon in this area. When the dams were built, they lost 80% of their historic spawning area. Plus there's not enough water released to push the salmon into the ocean. But most of the fish that we're gonna catch is hatchery fish. That's fish that are raised in a hatchery until they're five to six inches long. Then they're released into the wild. The Golden Gate Salmon Association and the state of California release millions of these fish into the rivers and bays in California. The fish you're going for are nowhere near the rivers, but they're in the ocean. So here you are leaving the harbor and you're ready for a salmon trip. It's just my dad and me. So I and my mom are gonna go on another day. What's great about the fishing trip is it's almost like a tour of a bay, with fishing included. That's the prison island Alcatraz, in San Francisco off in the distance. That's the Golden Gate Bridge we're going to go under. If you do do this fishing trip, make sure to have layers of clothing. It's always cold in this area. If you wear layers, you can take off one of your layers if you get warm. I still can't believe I get to go underneath the bridge. I've seen this bridge so many times in movies. And it's huge. As soon as we started passing the bridge, we started to see big schools of bait fish everywhere. Big piles of birds and jumping fish. Here we are almost to Point Bonito Lighthouse. It's not much further past that to the fishing grounds. So right here this is our setup and right here is one of the cool things about it. So this lead is 40 ounces and this thing is cool because when you got a fish at the end of the line, you don't want to be fighting a weight and a fish at the same exact time. So what this thing does is, it, once 
Imagine the fish comes on, it pulls this line, and then the lead falls down. This is our fishing setup. You can see the lead, the flasher, and the anchovy behind. We're finally at the fishing grounds. Here we are, just kind of trolling for salmon fish. A couple guys already caught. It's still the beginning of the day. Nice steady rhythm, okay buddy? Keep it going, keep it going real, real, real. Put your left hand up here. Yeah. Go. He's got you there. Keep going. Keep going, bud. When I say lift, slowly lift up for him, buddy. Keep real. Okay, real, 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 real. Alright, lift up, lift. Got it, Adam, boy. Nice, Jaden. Way to go, Jaden. fishing again. Here I just caught a couple of salmon and right now I'm still trying to catch more but all we do is just throw in the anchovies and then just had a bite. I caught a really big one. I can't wait to eat it. We let the lines out and we slow trolling. People in the front of boat are down like 30 feet, 
and the people in the back of the boat are down like 70 to 60 feet. When you do this type of fishing, you gotta change the bait like almost every five to 10 minutes. Here I am again, hoping to catch another good sized salmon. Hold on, the way that's the worst time to put it when you don't have to go under. Keep going, Jay, keep it going. Don't jerk it. The trick of these fish is to keep constant pressure on them. You're doing good, Jay. Just take your time. You're doing good. Let him fight. Let him fight. You got him, buddy? Yeah. Go the other way with it. I got you. more bigger that is than the other one, Jaden. <laughs> they got our numbers at six, Tommy. What, two yeah, six and seven. Oh, okay, stand next to him. Alcatraz Island. There's also been a bunch of movies filmed at Alcatraz. Everybody caught their limit super early. We were supposed to stay till three o'clock, but we came back at 10 o'clock. Because the fishing was so good. <laughs> 